Aubrey Chandler is a beast on the volleyball court, but the 12 year old couldn't always play the position she wanted. When the balls get hit and they go deep, you have to go dive and get it, like slam to the floor and like get it. But that was too much impact for Aubrey, who at 15 months old got a pacemaker. She was diagnosed with congenital complete atrial ventricular block. The condition often leads to a significantly slow heart rate and in complex cases requires a pacemaker. So what a pacemaker does is, is it provides artificial electrical impulses to control the heart rhythm. Dr. Chris Johnsroot is the director of pediatric arrhythmia services at Norton Children's. Aubrey's initial pacemaker inserted more than 10 years ago comes with a lot of limitations for a small child. In an active kid who's bouncing all over the place, uh, you can imagine that they can bounce uh, because this isn't deep in the tummy, uh, they can bounce and then injure uh, the, the device itself. But everything changed for Aubrey in December 2023 when Dr. John Drew decided to switch out her old pacemaker for a micro implant. It had been used on adults, but never on a child in the state of Kentucky. The micro instead is this little tiny thing like this. And you can see this little thing, it's smaller than a, a AAA uh, battery. Doctors implanted it through a vein in her leg and she was up and walking the next day. Dr. Johnsrud said it's been a joy to see how quickly this changed Aubrey's life. What they don't teach you is how cool it is when you can actually have a positive impact. And it's been fabulous. You seen her lately? She looks terrific. And Aubrey says not only can she play the position she wants in volleyball now, but she can do a whole lot more. I want to do cheer again and gymnastics and maybe play flag football this year. Carrie Grace, WLKY News.